ever wanted to edit your own performances at the Yamaha Disclavier? Maybe you've already tried editing with sequencing software, but became overwhelmed by the zillions of features available on many of these types of programs. Do you just need to touch up a couple of notes? Or maybe you have a Disclavier Pro and you need to retain the sophisticated XP data? Reperform, created by Zenf Sound Innovations, is exactly the tool you need for these jobs. In fact, it's the only music editor created just for editing performances from the Disclavier and Disclavier Pro. Please join me for a quick tour. Start by recording directly onto your Disclavier's hard drive. This will provide the most efficient capture of performance data as you play. When your recording is finished, you'll see your song's new title on the screen. Insert a USB flash drive into the Disclavier's Media Center. Tap the function button and scroll down to Copy Song. You'll choose your USB flash drive as the source. The copying procedure is similar on an E3. Once this is complete, you may move the flash drive to your computer for editing in Reperform. To launch Reperform, open the Zenf folder that's located in your Applications folder on a Macintosh or in your Program Files on a PC. Once Reperform is open, please select File, then Open. You'll be able to navigate to your recording from the flash drive icon. Once your file is open, you'll be able to see all the different notes and pedal strokes you played at the Disclavier. Use this slider to zoom in or out to be able to see more notes at the same time or more details and less notes at the same time. If you find that you'd like to change just one note, all you have to do is move it up or down the piano keyboard. It's just that simple. To see the pedals, select Show Right, Middle, or Left Pedals. I have selected to view my right pedal so I can see each pedal stroke I played. If I decided this pedal stroke was a little too deep, I can adjust it just like so. Each note is recorded with regard to velocity, which equals dynamics, as well as duration of each note. If I'd like to change that, I can simply click and drag. I can also easily change the dynamics of a particular note or group of notes. To change a group of notes, I select them with my mouse and alter the dynamics. If you'd like to do more sophisticated editing, you can open Gesture Properties. This is where you'll be able to see parameters such as the start times and end times of notes and with great, great precision, edit durations, notes, dynamics, and more. Unlike any other software on the market, Reperform preserves Yamaha's system-exclusive data, song titles, and the very sophisticated XP data from Disclavier Pro models. You'll find system exclusive data under Meta and SysX in the edit menu. Here you'll see all kinds of Yamaha specific messages that you can now control. If you'd like to add something, say a song title, you do that by adding Meta. In this case, you'll choose sequence, track name, type in a name, and then you'll be able to see that title on the Disclavier's PRC display. Once you have edited your performance, you'll want to save it with a new title and store the new version on your Disclavier as well. To do this, you'll simply drop the new file onto your flash drive and transfer it back to the Disclavier using the same copying procedure. 
Believe it or not, these are just a few of the features you can use to edit your own Yamaha Disc Clavier performances using ReProform software. To learn even more about this exciting new tool, please join our user forum at www.zenf.com. Here you can stay up to date with new software versions and share ideas with users from around the world. You may also follow us on Facebook and Twitter.